Uh, hey guys. Um, actually, hold on a sec. <laughs> yeah, this is Snack Attack 8, and welcome to part 10 of, uh, Let's Play Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Uh, <laughs> I have so many- this is my 10th part, um, but at the moment, I only have, like, oops, I didn't mean to do that. Um, I've only uploaded part 5, and that was, like, yesterday. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm way behind, um. So I guess in this part, I'll say that, uh, I'm going on vacation for two weeks, um, and this will probably be the last part I upload before I go on that vacation, I'm just assuming here, um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure that this will be, alright, we need to go in here now, this will be the last part that, uh, alright, so yeah, this happens, that I upload before I go on vacation. Alright, let's talk to Anju. Welcome to the Sock Pot Inn. Um, did you have a reservation? No. Because I forgot that I needed to put on a mask first. Anju the innkeeper was added. Blah, blah, blah. Let's get our cafe mask on. And... You're also looking for cafe? I have a request. Cafe, I have a clue that will help you find him. Tonight at 11, please come... 11.30, please come to our kitchen. We'll talk then. Promise to meet her at night. Alright. Um, there's not much else we can do around here for now. So, um, let's play the, uh, Song of Double Time. I don't think I've shown you guys this either, so. And that'll take us tonight, and then we're gonna have to wait. Which I'll off screen, because it would really just be me waiting around for the time to... See, now he's fast-forwarded. Um, one thing I really... Or one of my complaints on the time system is that, uh, yeah, oh, hey, I didn't even know that was up there. I, I think the, um, the, the little stray fairy in this town just kind of moves in different positions. So, um, that's the same one that was by the laundry pool, but since we, uh, restarted the day, it's in a different place. Or since we went all the way back in time. Um... I'll turn into the Deku scrub and then we will see you in a second at 11:30. All right, uh, back and it's almost 11 now. So let's hop in the flower. Um, because we can't go into the stockpot in when um it's night because that door's closed. So we gotta go up here. And in through this way. <laughs> Deku Link has to jump. There she is. She can't actually talk to us yet about the thing, I don't think, until she gets to the kitchen. So, uh, we're just gonna have to wait for that. Uh huh. Come on. <laughs> this takes a. some time to. do. I don't know why she can't just see us and tell us about the stuff now. I should probably turn into regular Link. There's a bug in here for some reason. I guess they have a really unsanitary kitchen. Alright. I'm sorry to trouble you so late at night. It's about him. Cafe. I received a letter from him. Strange, isn't it? Getting a letter from a missing person? But there's absolutely no mistaking it's from him. It's clear to me. Please. Here is my letter. Please put this in a post box. When this is delivered, when he receives my letter, you should be able to meet him. Please tell him that Anju is waiting for him. And please, after you've seen him, tell me how he looked. I'm scared. I, I can't go. Can I ask this of you? Sure. Thank you very much. Yeah. Got the cafe letter. Alright, please mail it immediately in the morning. Um. Oh, hold on. I think I know something else I can do now. Mm. It's, um. It's over this way. Whee! Um. So yeah, I think we, uh, 
mail the letter like right now. And then something should happen. But it, I think it takes a couple of days, so that means more off screening. There he is. We can talk to this guy. La la la, they said I was much too loud when I practiced in my room. They got mad, sigh, now I'm sad. I'll just keep thinking about the past to keep my mind off the bad. Ah yes, I'll do that. Dear guest, long ago I was in an animal troop with dogs and donkeys and such. Because all animal troops definitely have donkeys and dogs, that is so normal. Why coulda, why coulda, why could a man join? That's because a man is an animal, too, my boy. They were all great, but there was one thing I didn't like about it. Why was the, why was the, why was the dog? <laughs> why was the dog the leader? Was it because something was wrong with me, sir? Oh, that dog was an amazing leader. He always had a stellar troop, no matter what animals he worked with. That's why, that's why I, that's why I stole it. The dog's mask, I stole it. I wanted it because it was the leader's mask, but no longer need it. I give it to my guest. Alright, so we got the Bremen mask. Um, belong to the leader of an animal troop. Try parading it around tiny young animals. Um, we need that to get something later on. <laughs> the leader was a good instructor. His members matured quickly and they became adults in an instant. Guru Guru, the traveling musician, was added to your notebook. Yeah. Um, this is the guy from the windmill in Ocarina of Time. I mean, it's obviously not the same guy, but it's the uh, same character model. I'll just show you what the Bremen mask does. When you're wearing it, you can do this little march. It seems pretty useless right now, but um, it uh, it, it plays its importance a little later. Um, so I think I mail the letter now, and I'll I'll just put it in this post box. Stick it in there. Letter's been received. Ka-ching. Shall be delivered tomorrow. Alright, so, um, I'll off screen to this, the postman getting the letter. I don't know. Alright, so, um, the postman picked up my letter. I followed him around for like 10,000 hours. And now I think this happens. Yeah, see, he's taking it to, and oh, what's this? Who's that? Oh, it looks kind of familiar to somebody. And, uh, they talk. I don't know if I can talk to them. I have a letter for you, postman. Yeah. Um, and then he goes back inside. And I think I can follow him in now. There are red rupees down there, but I don't know how to get them. Yeah. There he is. Run! Run! Whoever you are, run! Alright. And we should be able to talk to him now. Yeah. Green hat, green clothes. Anju wrote about you in her letter. It seems you're looking for a cafe. Yes, I can keep a secret. And Anju trusted you. I shall also trust you. I am cafe. Oh! Wow, I'm so shocked. The, <laughs> the cafe we were looking for is an adult. When I look at you, I just see a child. I was turned into this by a strange imp wearing a mask. Skull Kid messes up everything. But I'm not hiding because I look this way. When I was turned into this, I went to see the great fairy in the shrine near the north gate. But on my way, on the way, my precious mask, a wedding ceremony mask, was stolen from me by some prancing man with a grinning face. We've, we've run into him before, but we didn't get a mask. Well, you're just careless. You're like my partner. Thanks, Tattle. I love you too. Before my wedding ceremony, I was quite happy. I was targeted because of what I had been turned into. Oh my, I pity you. I know Anju was worried, but I can't go out yet. I made a promise to her that I would bring the wedding mask and greet her. This pendant, give it to Anju. Yeah! We got the pendant of memories. 
Though you may not understand these grown-up matters, you should probably take the pendant to Anju anyway. Uh, keep what we just talked about a secret from everyone. Alright, um, so let's take it to her. And I think this is actually going to stretch into the next video. I don't believe I have time to finish this side quest. So, um... I only have like a minute or so left. I guess I'll, uh... I'll leave it here. Um, next time we'll go talk to Anju. Show her the pendant, all that good stuff. Bye, guys.